What's goody? YouTube, it's your boy SMT Teachers here, and as you can see, we're doing something a little different. I want to do uh, like a story game, but I don't have any story games, so I bought a game that I wanted to play for a while, which is the Batman Telltale series. So we'll see. I know the game's old, but just bear with me. All right, let's get right into the game. Probably gonna make my return to Twitch streaming later today. I was planning on doing it earlier, but then my grandma was here. Yeah. Uh, she's gone. So I guess I'll just wait till after I eat dinner. Probably. Seems like the most rational decision. How long is this fucking loading screen? Jesus Christ. Oh, there we go. The game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. You know, I'm kind of screwed. I was sucked in quick time events. Hey, what are you? <laughs> oh, what's your freaking internet? Oh, I don't Wait. feel like getting up. Show, bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. This is when is the Gotham City police? Oh, Christ. Move in. Good old buddy. Stories, you know, sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop fine. of blood, everything you've sacrificed. The city is safer now. Yeah, it's made you a target. Uh, quick time. I can barely see it. And I people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the sky. Criminals in this city. <laughs> they need something to fear. Well, the whole town's. <laughs> Shit! The hell did he go? Whatever got in, don't let it get out.
Back to back. Circle up. I know you're trying to create oh, a myth, on. but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! About to say. Mother teach you to knock. Behind you, big boy. Heyday. This is right here, not just stay. Intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Without a scratch. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. Like you broke the law. Right? Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. Gotham needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me, what, a villain? Sounds fun. Gotta admit it, though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild yeah, animal? So it's now. dangerous. Then let's put you in a cage. Bring it, Bat.
over. I wouldn't be so sure. Shoot! Go to all that trouble for this. Shit! A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. God damn it! I said don't shoot you! No! Wait! <clears throat> wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake, or yours. Who put you up to this? Answer me or I let go. But you won't. You're not that kind of guy. Bye, Bat. <laughs> Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Oh, shit. Oh, Time to save oh, the city. Oh. The hell is going Okay, I know what's going on. Peep, you know I had to make the bad tag red just because, you know. I oh, can't see it, but. You know. Too bad this isn't. Right. Too bad my mouse isn't red. Is that accidental? Oh, I almost accidentally unplugged my mouse. That'd have been fun. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. Yeah. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, no, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. I'm gonna do it. 
Hi, <laughs> Bruce. Well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. <laughs> thank you, thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Come on, Bruce. Say hi, Bruce. Together, we hi. will change Gotham. Mr. Wayne, uh -uh. thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner Say, everyone like will leave you alone. I... Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. Some they want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support <coughs> Harvey Dent! Support We're the grease, they're the wheels. Um, and they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham let's finish a place for families again. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public? This'll help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. I'm doing this for God. Now all I need is a decent I'm slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. I'm gonna do a new all face right, forever. All right, all right. How about, uh, a new face for Gotham? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. I don't want to say a city that free from crime, crime. where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know there these two. I was just Hello, saying, I Bruce. Zellerbach. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone yeah, like you to like lead this, this city right to greatness. Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Right. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. They keep telling like me birds. That that. You're preaching, it's dear. Like everything no, I say, it's though. true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out Ooh, vigilante Batman. justice like it's the wild Batman. goddamn West. Oh, Thanks. Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being oh, blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Well, I have to say I side with your wife on this, Mr. Zellerbach. Even a spark of hope can light the darkness. Oh, an idealist with a bank account. He'll be broke before election day. <laughs> and I know Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city. I don't doubt that for a moment. And don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne, in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age, it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, 
Well, I don't like to think about maybes. Oh, thank you. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. You can stay, Miss Vale. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. <laughs> Thanks. Bruce? This is quite the social event, Mr. Oh, Wayne. come on now. It's so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party better before all the champagne runs here. out. Yes, sir. I'm doing better now that you are here. Well, I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't around, I'd give you the private tour. Mr. Wayne, you've... you've got something on your collar. Um... is that blood? Yeah... it looks like... Maybe it's lipstick. Uh, actually, it's, uh... it's lipstick. Well, no wonder you were late. Say no more. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but, uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one anything. personally. Sir. Anything. Anything you want? Ms. Carmine Ray. Falcone? Is that Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Oh boy. <laughs> and what kind That's of business do you think he's in? Not the the one that controls person. enough so votes to get me into City Hall. <laughs> the freaking party. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. Like it's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. The biggest. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested oh, to speak with Harvey, you directly. What did you get yourself into? Maybe you can change your mind. I don't want him in my home. Actually, you don't want him angry. So Trust I was, me. I was looking at something. Word of warning, Bruce. Play nice. I'm not playing nice. <laughs> you, you know, I've been in the nice. market for a new a house. Criminal? Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends uh. my eyes. <laughs> Man, all flash, you know I no class. A bag, right? <laughs> well, you couldn't afford it. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, I'm not playing nice at Come all. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Too many cameras. Too many eyes. Vicky looking at me? You're a Confused. respectable no man. Uh -uh. Right You're not getting a handshake from me. If Vicky watching, you ain't getting shit from me, big dog. That's all I gotta say. Shit for me, big dog. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Yo, I'll follow me, this, if you will. Get this mug up out my house. <laughs> like, yo, kick it, old man. Uh, you should know, Mr. Falcone. My analysts say we're raising triple what Mayor Hill has. Um. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey tells him. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Yeah, Harvey Seen tells and me. not heard. Whatever ah, you. Ah, what did I say? Harvey gonna be pissed off, but I'm gonna rip into this. I'm a. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. 
But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. Oh, yes, sir. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, yeah, Mr. Falcone, I'd I know more be... warnings. I'd rather be... I ain't here to chinwag about it. politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Here we go. I had a feeling he's gonna do this. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. Is there a throw it at him? I can Actually, get Harvey the mayor. Leave it on the table. Or better. I can <laughs> pull it out from under him. Fuck that shit, bitch. <laughs> I got Whatever money. happened what to being a gracious host? <laughs> no. Okay, oh, imagine. No. This is me. Yeah, you do look like a pull uh, And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. He owns everything now. Still. That's if actually. Harvey gets elected. That's, That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. If need be. You and I ain't friends, huh? Yeah, that's <laughs> not happening. <laughs> like, hey, this I'm isn't a deal with the devil. Should I be your friend? You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. How come? Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. I think I'll have someone see you out. Okay. Okay. So that's how it's gonna be. People don't say no to me. I'm not even going Not, not for even long. Going. In my, my playthrough, I'm not even gonna pay no attention to when they call out my... Master Bruce, my your no, guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. In my opinion, you just, wouldn't want to be rude. It's pointless. Like, Heed your butler's advice, kid. Like oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. Alright, Vicky, you want the scoop? Because I can give you a scoop right now. I, I 